Welcome. I got a few extra minutes today, so I thought I'd show off some new features in Craft. Because it's brand new, uh, and this is timely instead of like my normal couple week uh, wait on some videos. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to show off the daily notes in Craft, which I think is kind of the big feature uh, out of all the new stuff that's out right now for Craft. So that's what we'll do. Before we do that, a few ways to support the channel. Number one is to become a patron, patreon.com slash Curtis McHale. Number two is to take one of my courses. You can go to Skillshare, curtismichael.ca slash Skillshare, take one of my courses, or you can actually find uh, all the links to them below. Zettelkasten is probably the one you might be interested in if you're watching Craft. That's it. Let's buckle up and look at the new Daily Notes feature in Craft. Let me open it up here. Oh, let me switch to our switcher here. And of course, I went to the wrong screen. So here we go. New daily notes in Craft. So it just came with the latest update to Craft. And what can we use it for? So one thing you could use it for is you could use it for meeting notes. So if I have a meeting today, right, I can actually link to the meeting. I can go right in here and I could talk about my meeting notes my meeting notes on this specific meeting. It shows me my notes for my calendar. So this actually links to my draft. So the drafts document that I have for uh, today, this should open it up in drafts for me. Yep, open it up in drafts, that's excellent. That's probably the biggest thing that I find is useful with the latest update to um, craft with the daily notes. Um, right, you access it by going to the bottom here, go to my regular notes, my daily notes, you can see I can turn off and on calendars based on what I want. Uh, that's really the biggest thing. Now, the other thing you can see in here is that I have a to do item, right, thing one, but if I go back, you can see that I have an overdue one, but there's no way to pull them forward at all. There's no queries, there's no, there's no way for me to deal with that. So it's okay in that respect, but I would say it's not spectacular. Um, now you can't do that with Obsidian either in your daily notes. You can't really pull tasks forward unless you're using a special custom query, something like that to let you know if you're using something like Slated, which is a community plugin, then there you can actually um, move a task forward manually, but you have to actually, you do have to go back to the day. So just like this, I'd have to go back to the day and I would have to move this somehow, right? I might be able to, how can I do that? copy it, right, I can copy and maybe paste it into a future day. Paste, no, didn't even paste, um, because I probably didn't highlight it. So if I went to here, uh, now can I copy, copy and paste it into day, this one. There you go, so now I can do it. So it's a copy and paste operation, it's a little smoother in Obsidian than it is here. So outside of that, we also have our search tab. That's gonna let us, if we have, lots of searches for something. Oh, what do I have lots of searches for? Let's say it is for reading. All right, we have lots of searches in here now. It's a little better. Does that go with our open tab as well? Reading. So that can be a better way to actually search through what you want to find. Um, if you're in a note, right, you can actually just drag this out. I can't just drag that out. So that's unfortunate. I can't drag any of these out. Open a new window, open a new tab. It'd be really cool if I could drag this out into my daily note to like link it in there. That would be a really cool thing. What if I come, how to be well read? Can I grab, no, you can't drag that out, unfortunately. I mean, there's no option to link to current document or anything. So I would love to see those improvements there. I'd love to see a way that you could find all um, old tasks that are undone, bring them forward into your current day. And I'd also love to see the ability to drag and drop from the search tab over to your note so that you can make linking easier because you can see it visually, just be an easier way to do it. We don't have that yet, but it's a decent step forward for craft. I like it, works great on iPad as well. Um, I think these are two things that make craft more useful for many people. That's really it. If you like the video, thumbs up below. If you loved it, subscribe, hit the bell. YouTube will let you know something happened. Uh, you can take my courses uh, on Zettelkasten, link below, or if you can go to curtismichael.ca slash Skillshare, you will get a uh, notification, or notification, you can go take a course there from me, or become a patron, patreon.com slash curtismichael. 
often streaming Fridays, 1 p.m. Pacific, um, about note-taking, research, Obsidian, craft, whatever I find interesting, and have a Discord channel, which will be linked below. Have an excellent day.